Okay, today is a great video. Today is a crazy video. Today is awesome. Today is uh, I go over to my buddy's place and I try and hold my breath. Oh, but sorry, it's in a tank of water, locked in a tank of water, like Houdini style. Yeah, my buddy does an underwater escape. His name's Matt Johnson. You might have seen him on uh, uh, Penn and Teller Fool Us. So that's him. So he just gave me sort of a rundown and I went and tried it out today. Uh, holding your breath is hard. Holding your breath underwater is harder. Holding your breath underwater in a tight little cramped thing with the lid locked on top of you is super hard and kind of weird and claustrophobic and it makes you a bit nervous. It's a strange one. But, um, yeah, <laughs> check it out. I feel good afterwards. Like, um, like I just went for like a run. You know? Cool little personal challenge and I, like I said, I feel good. I mean, my chest is completely fried because of yesterday, so uh, maybe maybe there's that. But it has been fun all day walking around telling people like, oh yeah, I did a thousand push-ups yesterday, so that's been kind of sweet. You guys are gonna love this. Uh, you're gonna love Matt, he's a character, he's a good buddy of mine, and I think you're gonna love watching me and him try and drown each other, so, uh, so yeah, check it out. Here we go. I grew up a farm. Oh, well, that's probably why you wanna get away from it. Although, I didn't grow up on Yeah, Wes. Everybody's wondering what's going on. Okay, everybody, this is Matt. Matt Johnson. Matt, say hi. Hey guys. Hey. What's this? And, what's that? That's. I don't know what that is. What is that? Is that yours? I wouldn't wear anything. I'm getting in here naked. You know that, right? Oh, dude, that is actually Dana's crop top. Well, that I makes it was more your sense. Speedo for a no. second. Uh, I'm gonna get in Matt's water tank today. Kill a wasp. He's gonna kill a wasp. Oh, don't leave it. Okay. I'm gonna get in Matt's water tank with zero experience on being in water tanks or holding my breath. He's gonna give me a crash course, don't worry. In here, so water's low right now, but obviously when you get in. Actually, how much do you weigh? 190. Okay, I'm 220, but right. it may not come to the top when sure. you get in it. But if it doesn't, then just jam your face underwater. <laughs> I did have some goggles, but I don't have them. That's I don't fine. know where they are, so you I just can close I'll your suffer. eyes. Right, you're all right not clipping your nose or whatever. Yeah, right? that's fine. You'll find it a little bit more roomy for you than me. Yeah. Uh, so you'll probably be fine anyways. I always put my butt in that back corner and my legs kind of crossed here in front of me. Okay. Uh, you can you can put all your weight on this. You don't have to worry about that. Wow, this is fucking crazy. Uh, inch plexiglass. Richard Sherry in Calgary, escapology guy built it. Cause that's the old one there. See the Look back? that. Yeah, but it's not just that. On this corner, this entire side is separated. So, so it just really blew apart. Yeah, so that separated, this all is... the water came out, it buckled back and it cracked down. But there. this new one even looks better. Like it's more outlined, you know, like a, this, yeah, is, a, this a, is sick. A, a vintage rust. But he, uh, yeah. So, uh. Speedo style, right? All right, you ready? Okay. In you go. <laughs> <laughs> Matt's not even in here right now. Oh shit, I did a thousand push-ups yesterday and my chest is obliterated you right now. You can tell though, you can <laughs> tell. Okay. Let's give me some of my... Have you been in the sun as well? You got burnt <laughs> arms. <laughs> You're looking in shape actually. I feel like no, an asshole see. right now. <laughs> you look I, like an asshole. I wore these to be funny and really it's only just a joke on myself. So uh, These are for my stag. Hey YouTube, what's up? I'm only gonna get a million views. I... So hang on, what's the best way to get the... So at least you I can breathe make... up. Yeah, so I, want, I don't want to be in here right. for 20 seconds. All right, look, so what's going to happen is, if you were to drop on you, you're going to get whatever you can hold, right? right? But one of the tricks to holding your breath is doing a good breather. CO2 that's in your lungs, it's bad oxygen, because what's going to happen is when you try and hold your breath, that minute where you feel like you've got to breathe is not you having to breathe. There's plenty of oxygen. It's the CO2 burning your lungs saying, get me out of here. Right. That's when panic kicks in, and that's why people come out if they can. So you can do it. This is a mind so, game. Yeah, but the, the, the training is learn how to deal with the CO2 feeling. And to learn that when that kicks in, that fight or flight, and you're in pain, the training is to stay under and force yourself through that. That's what the that's what breath holding training is about. So in. Because purging, what you're doing there is you're purging the CO2, right? Under. Okay. Right? Sick. What would be like a reasonable, like, what would be like a reasonable number to hit for time, for your first, first timer? For somebody trying to hold the breath underwater in a regular pool with no constraints, 
30, 45 seconds, possibly a minute okay. is good. What you got to realize in this tank is it's a fucking mind fuck? You might not because you're crazy, but what you got to realize in this tank is when you go under and the lid closes and I padlock it shut, yeah. the feeling, I'm not going to lock the lock, but I'm going to put it through. Okay, so you fine. can't just pop the lid open. So what, that goes under the crazy, not stupid category. What you're going to do, if you need to get out, just give me a bang on the top, yeah, but don't wait until you've got no breath left because it's going to take me a few seconds to get the lock off and open the latch. Right. Right? Right, okay, yeah. Um, 30, 45 seconds, possibly a minute. Ooh, in a pool, <laughs> in a pool, you're nervous now. Me. And anybody that watches these things on YouTube, or whatever, anybody that watched me on Penn and Teller, all these guys watching it and going, "Oh, I held my breath with him and I can do it." Well, sitting on a chair in your living room, going like this. Oh yeah, and you were you were handcuffed and shit. Too. Yeah, yeah. Different so. story. So you're gonna experience a little bit of what it cool. feels like without the locks and chains, right? Right. Ooh, it is chilling. I'm taking it. Uh, we're filming. I would do a test stuff. I just, I just put your head underwater for safety's sake. I just put yeah. your head underwater. Hold your breath, don't do a big breathe up, just go, <gasps> hold your breath and go underwater. And let me close the lid. Let's do that no first. No way, man. For, let's just do it for real. No, I'll do it for real, okay. <laughs> All right. All Ready? right. Yeah, I think so. Okay, so I'm just gonna do some fucking purging and then we're gonna go under. Yeah. Three purges on the floor. guys we'll see how he does it's my buddy Wes Barker yeah, crazy Looney Tune come on Wes That is trippy as shit, man. Are you ready? Whoa, was it 25 you, seconds? <laughs> you, you did really good. For, for being in that tank, That's weird. this time you did really good. When I'm in that tank, when I was in that tank on Penn and Teller, I'm actually only under there for a minute 50 seconds, but I'm chained up and trying to escape, right? Holy you shit. You were just under there for 40 seconds. Fuck off, man. So I'm under there for three times that. You're right. Like I'm chained and handcuffed. On a straight, on a straight breath hold, I can do like a minute, minute thirty, like any day of the week. On the drive out here, I was just practicing and hit like a minute thirty. You're listening to this, right? It's people fucked. on YouTube. Forty seconds. Straight breath hold. You can do a minute, minute forty in your car, whatever. Yeah. I think it's in that position. I don't. I don't. I've never held my breath like. Well, first of all, when you're in that position, it crushes your lungs up, yeah. right? which which automatically takes away the breath hold. Secondly, you're going into a situation you're not used to, and thirdly, you hear the lid close yeah. and, and a padlock go it's on it. Weird. Your brain just goes because you were blowing bubbles out at 25 seconds. I noticed that. That was you getting ready to come out. Yeah. Right. So it it's it, you can't even explain. So now, do you want to go back under and put yeah, a set of handcuffs on? No. Uh, well, I don't know. I want to. Like, what? Your hands are going to be up through the holes, and you're going to go under, but keep your hands up through the holes, yeah, yeah. as if they're padlock, as if they're chat, as if they're. Oh fuck! So you're in a really weird position, eh? Do, do, do you know? I mean, if you. Yeah. All right. Do you want to feel the handcuffs on? Do you want to just go? We won't film this bit, just so you can feel it. <laughs> sure. Yeah. So this time what I want you to do, don't try and open those handcuffs, try and forget they're there because there's no difference you going underwater now because yeah. I'm going to let you out. I'm not going to padlock this shut. Okay, yeah. So you can pop back up into this position. Right. So try and forget that they're there but your psyche is going to say to you, no, they're not. No, they're still there. Yeah. I'm chained in. So now if you want to get out, you have to let me know before you want to get out because otherwise I'm not going to get it off in time. Right? Right. So you can trust me, I got you. Yeah. This isn't gonna be a lot and that chain's not around your neck. This is a little part of yeah. what it feels like. So I'm coming like. back up just to this position like this. Yeah, Whenever so having those handcuffs on now, <laughs> you get, that already feels weird. Yeah, right? oh fuck, this is crazy, all right, I love right. it. And now imagine Penn and Teller sat there <laughs> staring at you and, you're like, and you've already had a disaster on Britain's Got Talent oh. and you're trying to calm yourself to be under there for a minute, 50 seconds. I can't come out if I want to. Fucking hell. All right. So you ready? Yeah. Don't try and get the handcuffs off or anything. Just stay, just leave them on, but just, just let it ride it out.
There he is. Folks, I would never wear that bathing suit, by the way, under there. That's crazy. Yeah, because I was like, oh, how do I tap on the roof now? <laughs> you actually got 50 seconds there. Hey, going up. 50 Woo! seconds is good, man. You're starting to get used to the space a little bit more now. Yeah, that's what I, I, well, I knew what to expect this time. Two things going on, really. Forget the lock picking. One is breath holding practice, and two is psychological. Maybe we'll do one more in a minute, but this time, don't take those off, but I want you to act with your fingers like you're doing it. Yeah, and where, oh yeah, because you have to, these are the first thing that comes off, right? Yeah. So you do this, then you go down into your neck. Yeah. And then you come out and do the, the, the key. Uh, I have you 30, find the key. 30 keys around you find the, the key, and, and then you and go I keep out. coming up and trying each one. So here's what we're gonna do this time, actually. Yeah. You're gonna go under, right? Round about the time, I'll give you 20 seconds. At 20 seconds, uh, I'm gonna take the handcuffs off. Okay. When I take the handcuffs on, you, you're gonna bring your hands in. Yeah. And you're gonna try and shift yourself, shift position. So sure. your back's gonna be over there, your legs are over here. Okay. <laughs> try not to put too much pressure on the sides, sure, right? Makes sense. So you're gonna shift yourself. And then when your hands are in, you're gonna bring them up to your neck and mind like you're undoing a lot. Yeah. Right? Wow. Usually that takes me about 10 to 15 seconds to get that off. Yeah, I'd like to hit a minute, but if I'm gonna be moving around, I wonder what I'll do. It'll be fun. All right, let's try it. So yeah, take the handcuffs off for like 20 seconds. And it's funny because this water tank makes your body look like twice the same. I know, I look gross at that angle. Dude, you look so that's good. That, dude. That, you look that's my body. There, there you go. go. Look, that's look at this, look at this. this. Oh, we're doing this. Uh, arms are legit sore now. What's going on here? I, uh, Time, like that time, you're at one minute, so I'm in there twice as long. Dude, moving is not good for you. Oh, moving is not good at all. Right? That's crazy how your body though. You let you held your breath longer. Did I? You did 50 before, now you did a minute. Fuck man. And I actually tricked you a little bit. I didn't let the handcuffs off till 30 seconds. Oh, that was a good trick then because I could you, you had you thinking holy shit, that's 20 seconds. Yeah, ah. that's why I thought for sure I was under. Wow. Yeah. Fuck me, man. I, this is years of practice to get good at this, I bet, yeah. It's I, been a year and a half for me, and I'm still not there. I still go under, like in a pool, I can do three, 3.30. When I'm doing this, I'm doing just shy of two minutes. Because I, I, I don't spend enough time. I've spent a lot of time, but as you know, because I'm a magician, I've got all these other things going on. I don't devote enough time to this to be able to get there. This morning I was in there, I pulled a full escape with just under two minutes, but, I wanted to come out in a minute. You know that feeling you get of it's hurting? Yeah. That's the feeling I get in a minute, but then I do another minute. Oh, fuck. Past, past that. <laughs> yeah, that's fucked, man. This is this is cool. Thanks for letting me do this. This is a, this is an experience. So, um, fuck me, man. Yeah, this, uh, this month of videos is gonna get me into some interesting shit. And it's in front of a live audience, so the tension's off. Live audience. You're scared. National TV, when you're just fucking crazy. You're scared. You, you, well, because you, already before you go under, you're losing because you're talking, your heart rate's you're going. Oh, yeah. And it's burning oxygen a mile a minute. But you can take a beta blocker or something. You should have fucking popped some pills. 
You didn't drink today yet, did you? No, that's, that's it. You're drinking afterwards. See, be more B-roll. Yeah, there's. Are your uh, are your tattoos gonna wash off when you get in there? They might. They might. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, they might. Yeah. Good. Yeah. <laughs> That's how the pros do it, man. Look at this guy. Oh, he's struggling now. <laughs> That's badass. How long is that? That's the full minute, minute 53 minute seconds. Minute 53. Let's all thank Matt. Hey, thanks, Matt. Wes, yeah. thanks for coming, hanging buddy. out, buddy. You're welcome, up. My Me, Casa, me, tank. is <laughs> to tank. That's not, not, not anything. That's um, yeah, so I'm gonna link to Matt's stuff. If you wanna see more of his stuff, check it out right here or there or wherever I put it. Good experience, I didn't die. Don't try this at home, kids. Hey, and, I don't know. What? Yeah. Wait, I've been in everybody swims. <laughs> oh, my. Oh. oh. People and their dogs, I don't know yeah. if I understand yeah. it. Yeah. All right. Let's go. I gotta go do a gig tonight, so it's gig time. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, if you did, let me know in the comments below uh, or on my Instagram. I'd really like to see everybody on my Instagram. I'm posting way more stuff there about behind the scenes and stuff that doesn't make it onto YouTube. And I can let you know when the videos are gonna come out. It's just way easier, more efficient way for you to connect to me. I wanna hear from you, at Stunt Magician. Yeah, hit me up there, and I hope you're enjoying this. I know I am. Been crazy two days already. Uh, who knows what's coming up tomorrow? Well, I know, but you don't know. But you gotta tune in and find out. Yeah, hope you're enjoying yourself. So take care, and I will see you tomorrow. That's crazy. What is it gonna be day? day three of 31. Let's do it. Uh, so back with you, but uh, okay. I've always got lots I gotta get done. So. Okay. Yeah. Day two, one, your balls to another. Celebratory beer. Have you guys met Damien yet? He did all the camera work of this YouTube video. Hey guys. And he didn't so, hold his breath, so he didn't earn a beer. I sacrificed. I sacrificed so these guys could enjoy their beer. <laughs> he has to hold the camera, and then he doesn't even get a beer at the end. This is bullshit. It's bullshit, what? Matt. My favorite beer, though. They're not a sponsor, but they will be. They will be. <laughs>